Hey everyone, I know it's been a while since my last video, but uh, I just couldn't wait to make a video on this, the A5 jailbreak. Uh, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to jailbreak your iPhone 4S on 5.0 and 5.0.1, as well as the iPad 2 on 5.0.1. In this case, I'm going to be jailbreaking the iPad 2, it's in 5.0.1, and we're going to be using Windows. So the first thing you're going to do, depending on what uh, computer you have, is uh, go down to the description box below and you're gonna uh, you're gonna download AppSynth from the links there once you download it you're gonna get a file a folder but what you're gonna have to do first is unzip it you're gonna have to extract everything once you do that you're gonna double click it and you will open AppSynth and this is what you will get you will get this so you, you should run as administrator and you're gonna get um, do you want the following program to make changes and you're gonna put yes okay and now that you have this and as you can see it has already detected iPad 2 on iOS 5.0.1 and uh, you just gotta click the button to begin so this is actually a pretty simple process it's just like the usual jailbreaks except that this might take a little longer than usual also right before we click that jailbreak button right there what you want to do is make sure that you have removed a uh, passcode from your from your iPad or iPhone. So you can see I don't have a passcode in mine. So you can see right here. All right. So after you remove the passcode, what you will do is click on jailbreak, and it will begin the jailbreaking. And then, as you can see, it does tell you that this may take a while. And uh, there's been a lot of people, you know, saying that it takes anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes. Uh, per process so in total it should take you about 30 minutes to 45 minutes if, if anything more it you should just wait as you can see your computer that's gonna be the first thing is gonna say uh, restore in progress and then we should wait for this and then as you can see up here you will see that your computer says uh, sending initial data your device will appear to be restoring a backup this may also take a while so at this point you should see the computer saying uh, waiting for reboot it's not done yet so don't unplug your device yet as you can see the, uh, your device should be rebooting and we should, all we can do right now is just wait and still waiting for the reboot to complete as you can see right here still rebooting again you guys this could take anywhere from a couple minutes to 15 minutes so I suggest you guys be patient with it and now you should see um, preparing jailbreak data on the uh, jail jailbreak tool AppSynth as you can see it says preparing jailbreak data at this point you should see sending payload data this may take a while do not touch your device yet when it tells you that you, you should be uh, that this may take a while then you should be very patient because it can take up to 15 minutes approximately 15 minutes and all we can do here is just wait now I am skipping through some of this uh, process just so we don't have a 30 minute long video so I'm trying to make it as easy as I can to show you guys the steps and as you can see still there so I'll come back when this uh, process is done so as you can see it says almost done just unlock the screen if necessary and tap jailbreak to finish so what we're gonna do is unlock and we're going to look for AppSynth. As you can see it, it's right here. We're going to open it up. Make sure you're um, connected to the internet. Wi-Fi 3G. And as you can see, it says um, it's now setting things up. Please stand by. And if, you're, uh, if you feel like it's taking too long, you should just be very patient. Because um, as you might know, there's a lot of people trying to jailbreak at this point. So you should be very, very patient. This might take a while. You never know. So at this point you just need to wait. So at this point your um, 
I device should be rebooting. So you can see, right after clicking Absinthe, uh, it reboots and it's getting ready to install Cydia. So just be patient. It took me a while, so if if you're stuck at the Absinthe screen for a while, don't worry. Uh, it, it would uh, it'll eventually do the jailbreak. If you have any questions, please feel free to uh, post them in the comment section below. And uh, as you can see, I have Cydia installed on my on my iPad too. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. And uh, well, this is the video, guys. Thank you for uh, watching my videos again. As always, please rate, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment on the down here on the page and I'll try my best to answer all your questions alright thank you guys and I'm just gonna do this little extra part so you guys can see that I do have it installed I'm gonna uh, click on user done and here we go there it is you guys alright enjoy the jailbreak <laughs>